Hi, welcome to M Squared Productions, another training video. This time we're going to look at how to place a banner on your website. In this case, it'll be at Marketingverse. Well, let's go to the web and we will let's go into our back office of our win. Easy way to get there, guys, is just to go to your winoffice.com. And then you click on login member. It's going to log me directly in because I have already got there. Go to website and then scroll down to marketing toolbox. And then from there, we want to go to banners. And what we're going to do is don't use this new banner. It doesn't have the code correctly, guys. So what we're going to do is we're going to come down here. We're going to use this banner. Now, let's go up here. I've already got a second window already open. So let's go into our marketing verse. If you didn't have a second window, please open one. Um, okay. And I'm going to log in there. I'm, I'm still logged in from last time I was here. Going to go create. And we're going to go down here to say add capture page. And I'm going to scroll down here, guys, and I'm going to hit the blank template. And then I'm going to just choose one. We'll just choose this one. Okay. And then we're going to go select. Now what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to give it a name. So this will be your domain. If you'll see right down here, you can see this is what it's going to be, your domain plus this. And so I'm just going to call this Banner 1. you got to choose a campaign. I have a dummy campaign that I use. I call it Test VB because we were testing the voice broadcast system one day. Now you have to put something in here. So I'm just going to put Test. And then we're going to just come down here, guys. Now, what I want to put my banner right here in this. Uh, this is a table. So I want it centered. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a bunch of X's, guys. A whole bunch of them. Okay, now we've done that. Now we're going to go source code. And then don't let this scare you, guys. What we're going to do is right click inside here and then go Control A and then Control C. And then I want you to open up Notepad. And then I want you to, here's my notepad open down there, Do click inside, do a control V. Now we just have saved a copy of the source code. If we mess up, we can come back and paste it back in there, guys. Now what I want you to do is scroll down till we find that big long X's. There we go. See, now we found these X's. And now what we're going to do is we're going to just highlight all the X's. And we're going to hit enter about five times. One, two, three, four, five. That just gives them some space. And we're going to go back up one, two, about the center of it is what I like to do, guys. And now what we're going to do is we're going to go back to our win network. And we're going to copy all this information right there. And we're going to hit Control C. Now we're going to go back over to our marketing version. Hey, wait a minute. Where's my form? If you look in your toolbar, guys, you'll find there's a separate form. There it is. And what we're going to do now is just right click and say paste. Or you can do Control V. And then we're going to say OK. And now we have our new banner in there. So we'll come down here. And we'll hit create page. It's going to create the page. Okay. Now what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to look at it. And we're going to come down here. And we know that it's going to put it on the last page. So we'll go to the last page. And it was called banner 1. And so we'll come here's banner one. Now, if we published it, it'd go live to the web. I'm just going to do a preview to see if the banner worked. The banner's in here. It's where I told to put it. And I'll click on it, and it goes to the win. Hope this helps. Y'all have a great day.